How many Germans in Aachen, Trier, Würzburg, Munich, Cologne, Düsseldorf, Mirbusch, all told me, get the fuck out my country, get the fuck out my country. But they <clears throat> actually came to my country with doctors, locked me in an electric room, yeah, told me I'm not Canadian, I never worked in IT, and I never graduated university, poisoned, injected me, and tortured me for seven weeks, that's all, all fucking K. Yeah, do whatever they want. So then this whole political asylum thing is bullshit. So you go to Munich, you have SAP lying, Sky lying, all the lawyers lying. You have lawyers going to Munich Arbeitsgericht, faking signatures, terrorized on every Deutsche Bahn, attacked with axes, baseball bats. <clears throat> and it's not just Germans. The Germans have given the green light for anyone to commit any fucking criminal act. Yeah, it's all bullshit in order to kill. You go to a job center in a country with 80 million fucking people, yeah, and you're banned from every fucking job center. You have everything stolen in the Dusseldorf Hofbahnhof with 100 USBs of evidence paying off people. The Starbucks people inside there knew exactly what was going on because as soon as I took my camera out, they all start ducking their heads. It is a genocidal attack of one human being, so Germany will get paid. Even if I get out of Germany alive, they'll still get paid for terrorizing me for two years and making my life such a nightmare that it's impossible to live here. They are breaking every EU, UN, international human rights law all over the place and still projecting this civil rights movement to the whole world. It is the big, one of the biggest fraudulent political lies in history.